Welcome back to Character Select. Um, this is a new recording session. Uh, so we just saw the cutscene again where Alexander slash Caduceus slash Gwydion. Caduceus the Magnificent. Melted down this puzzle. So I guess we're moving on. Where Not did sure. I go wrong? I mean, I could mention a lot of things that have gone wrong. Yeah. The puzzle was destroyed. And it was not going to be reset any time soon. Thank God it was destroyed. This looked like a nightmare. Aw, oh, you're not the puzzling kind, are you? Shame. All these twisty staircases look like so much <laughs> more fun than those. This is really making me want to play the original puzzle. King's Quest series, too, I swear. Well, we still gotta do, uh, two. Yep. Can I go up these stairs? Nope. Oh, yes. No, uh, it doesn't help with anything. Yeah, there's no point. So I guess just go through the door. <laughs> to the door, to the door, to the door, to the door. Wait, what? Oh, oh look, it's Alexander. Future. Should we save a plate for Dad? I brought him food earlier. <sighs> he refused to eat. He's too preoccupied with this next pig adventure he's cooking up in his head. Oh, oh we finally get to see them. Once adventure is on his mind... He can't focus on anything else. He's never lost his drive. You have to give him that. Well, I've never regretted retiring my questing boots. It allowed me to devote my full attention to raising my daughter. Isn't that You're right? still wearing the same oh, goddamn tunic you wore in the fucking sixth game? Stop. You're embarrassing me. Oh, come now, Alexander. We were raised going on adventures, and we turned out just fine. Well, mm, adventures. Part of this balanced breakfast. Gart. He's been questing since he yeah, look at Gart and have and doofy hair. Douchebag face. So well, thanks for saying so, Mother. Oh, I do hope you decide to take Gwendolyn on her own adventure soon. She's oh my God, what is this? A rite of passage? Yeah, Jesus Christ. <laughs> she can go out well, they are the all in an adventure old. game. We like to do things a little differently in the Green Isles. You can say that again. Oh my god, the references! Addendums and far too few decrees. <clears throat> Pardon the interruption, milady. I don't actually know oh, where Rosella is the queen of. Thank you. God. And leave a letter. The chambermaid found this crumbled up oh. in the waste bin. Guard! I'm assuming it fell. Yes, um... Thank the shining stars they found it. You lying over for that. It twit. Was right off my desk. It's gonna say something else, but Give it here. I'll, I'll deliver it right after supper. No need. Nope. I'll deliver it myself in the morning. Guard, I told you to keep the windows closed in your room. <laughs> oh, she knows. There. You <laughs> screwed, boy. Boy. Mm-hmm. Please. Here, Gwendolyn. Please. Oh, apologies. I thought that was a nint mouse squeaking in the courtyard. What a fucking what did you say? dick. <clears throat> I asked you to please pass Gart, the... Please pass the peas to your cousin. The little highness can reach them herself. I'm not here to serve her. Okay, you so for the record... To serve children, but enough. Oh. There you go, dear. So for the record, I've always been a much now, bigger fan of Alexander than I was of Rosella. Mm -hmm. Mainly because I never played King's Quest 7 and King's Quest 4 was kind of frightening. But I gotta admit, Guard's not really helping. What qualities do you possess that would make for a good king? Well for Oh, here comes the down castle and train to properly take over the kingdom. Unlike some other children who have only had adventures in their imaginations. Boys, I don't like where this conversation is going. Daventry is our home, Alexander. You chose to run oh, away with the princess and rule over her kingdom. Rosella came back? Huh. Would make a good king. Huh, okay. Know. I hear Kyle has some big ideas. Kyle? <laughs> really? oh, you're acting like a buffoon. Well, if this is how children raised by royalty treat their elders, then I'm proud that Gwendolyn and I grew up outside these castle walls. What? Oh, this is going to be a family big family problem. Dietary. It would be an honor for me to be king. But for you, it's just a burden. Knock it off, Gart. No, you're just a little girl. 
Nothing more than a dreamer. If you didn't encourage Grandfather's ramblings, he might actually notice that I am the only man for the job. Oh, can we punch him? Sit down. You're embarrassing the family. Ah! You will never be half the king Grandpa is. And he would never, ever leave the kingdom to such a spoiled, thoughtless child. I may be a little girl, but you're the one that needs to grow up. Ah, uh, distress. <laughs> <laughs> It would be best to cool off in your rooms. Everybody. No one is allowed Things to are heating up. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh god, the puns. I wonder if that food there that's being served depends on what you did in the other games or something. Why would it? Well, like they had the raisin croissants. The Grandpa? porridge you got from Can the I prison. Uh, I don't know. Etc. Sneaking in here, I was told everyone was sentenced to their chambers. You know what that means? <laughs> it's time for more adventure room, story. Take this time to reflect in my journal. No, it means you should pull up a chair. <laughs> and I can finish this. Graham, you're the best. <laughs> I think I crossed the line tonight. Oh, I'm sure you did. Good thing this story is all about crossing lines. Like those stupid lines on those stupid floor puzzles. Like, uh, do, I don't want to go check out that door. I want to look at this thing. Like, the writing in this is so good. Well, so, you checked it out. I'm glad you did. That was worthwhile. How about checking this dude out? I think the beard is too much. My wife says it itches her, but I think it's dignified. I hate beards. I hate beards. Mm. Hate them. I have a goatee Hates and I hate it. I hate it. So, what about the door up? I find this puzzle is mm. easier without all that extra weight, Mr. Majesty. Hmm. I don't think we missed anything, though. Can I go back? Nope. Because there was a door on the next floor, though. Yeah, I know. But I don't think we... Oh, no. What? What? That seems... I mean, this is an easy one. Um, yeah, okay. Might as well grab them all. Cool. Amazing that you could... Graham is like fit as a fiddle, I swear to God. Done. I oh, think. you have to... Unless you have to do it for all three? But I don't have a cross piece, so that won't yeah. work. Hmm. Now let's see what happens. Oh, it doesn't go across. Can you pick up the one right in front of you? Huh. Hmm. Huh. But it's still red. See how it's not lighting up? Something. Well, I don't think that matters. I think it just has to go in the right direction. No, it's still... Hmm. Maybe. Can you... Can you go to the right? Like, walk to the right for a second? And then don't pull the lever, just... Uh, what did I just say? <laughs> you said pull the lever. Don't pull the lever. Don't pull the pull lever. The lever. God damn it. I thought I saw something. I don't know if I actually did. Hmm. 
Okay, wait, wait. Just walk to the right for a second. Without pulling the lever. The light's getting through. See how it's on, in, it's on the right-hand side there? Yeah. Oh, you know what I think it is? You have to reflect it? Yeah. Okay. All right, so this puzzle is not as easy as we initially assumed. No, it's pretty easy. Is it now? Is it? Now I want to play magic. Um... So yeah, you can't put them down directly. Oh, it can't be that easy, though. Nope. Uh, wrong one. Every time I hear that sound, I'm like, ooh, points, but no, it's not points. <laughs> Unless I calculate them at the end of the fifth game. I probably not, because we would have just freaking maxed out our points there. And then you have to put them down so that they turn the red to purple with the blue light. What? Because it has to be purple colored. But when you put them down on the bottom one, oh, the one that you're I standing on now. Is. You have yeah. to put the opposites on each thing. <laughs> Clever girl. All right. So. I'm just going to let you puzzle this one out. I you figured out the broad strokes. You take care of the rest. Die in a fire. <laughs> what? No. What? 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 <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. God. Uh. Eh. Eh. And then straight down? You've got three straight downs, which I means have four you... straight downs. Oh, so that should do it then. You just don't have enough to do five straight downs, but or three straight downs and three straight downs, so that should do it. As long as you've got a lefty to downy. Of course I do. Yes. And then you have one left over. Which is fine. The, did I do this in the wrong order? No, I think you're okay. I think I might have done it backwards. Well, we'll find out. Skip the cutscene. Nope, I got it. Dang, we smart, yo. Door. Oh, I, I do go say, back in that room. This is so much easier alone. Mm-hmm. Why? It's not like, like, what's his face did anything. All right. So next time on character select, we will continue to mistreat our son. Poor Cromwell. <laughs> <laughs> So thank you very much for watching. Make sure to click that like button down below if you liked it. And Tyler. Crumpet? Um. Churchill. Crustacean. Okay.